Hi there, it's Joshua from Thermotech. Today we will be showing you how we test uh, thermal performance on our case. First of all, this is our um, temperature and humidity chamber. And these are data acquisition device. Next, these are thermal couples. They will be placed all around the case to collect temperature information. And the software we will be using our MSI uh, Afterburner and ROG Furmark. Now let's keep watching. We will run the system at full load for at least one hour. We have divided the chassis into three zones and the temperature of these three zones should remain steady and pass the goal we've set. We will test the Intel system first and the temperature of the three zones should remain steady at around 15 degrees Celsius over the ambient temperature. This is the goal we've set for the Intel system. First, we need to build the system properly to make sure the Tower 100 is ready for the thermal testing. We have the Intel test system ready first and here is the list of all the hardware we have installed for the Tower 100 build. The chassis model is the Tower 100 Snow the CPU we are using is the Intel i9-9900K and the motherboard is an ASRock Z390 ITX. For memory, we are using the Tough RAM Z1 RGB and for the graphics card, we will be using a GeForce RTX 3090 Gaming OC 24GB. For the cooler, we will be using a Freo Extreme Silent 14 Duo plus 140mm fans at the rear and at the top. Last but not least, for and for the power supply, we'll be using the Tough Power GF1 ARGB 850W. We will have a total of 17 thermoscopes laid out at various points in three zones. The most important points we need to focus on will be the intakes at the CPU and GPU intake locations, which at number 101, 104, 105, and 106. CPU and GPU are the main components that generate the heat inside of the case. And a well-designed chassis has to make sure the temperature will not be too high inside the case. Set up the temperature and humidity chamber with the temperature set at 25 degrees Celsius and the humidity set at 50%. Now everything is set. We are ready for testing. We will run the systems for an hour and check the records from the data acquisition device. The first system we tested is the Intel system. The CPU is an Intel i9-9900K and the GPU is a Gigabyte GeForce RTX 3090 Gaming OC. The Intel i9-9900K is a high-end CPU which generates more heat than other CPUs. We set the goal for this test to keep the temperature inside the chassis around 40 degrees Celsius, which is 15 degrees Celsius higher than the ambient temperature. Shown on the test results, the CPU and GPU intakes in the Tower 100 can successfully keep the internal temperature around or under 40 degrees Celsius. Therefore, the Tower 100 passes the thermal testing. So as you can see, this is how we test our thermal performance for every new case. Thank you.